Aaron just said he felt like you did a really nice job dictating counts, especially early on. How were you able to do that? Yeah, I was attacking the zone. Um, kind of, you know, went with my strengths, uh, which has been working for me. Um, felt like they were looking inside a lot, but I was able to beat them. He had said in that sixth inning he would typically leave you in in that scenario, but early in the season didn't want to go too far with that pitch count considering some long at-bats. Were you hoping he would leave you out there? Yeah, that's what he told me when he came to get me. Um, I told him uh, before he got there to talk to me at least, and uh, he pulled he pulled me right away uh, and then told me that in other situations he would leave me, but since so early, um, he, he, he pulled the trigger. How perplexed were you by the glove situation and after that first inning? Uh, I mean, I wasn't bothered by it. I just, it, it, it just kind of, you know, I've been pitching with the with the white 44 forever. So uh, the fact that he came o over to me and said that it was a problem um, kind of pissed me off. But other than that, I mean, I didn't have a big problem with it, big issue. Sorry. But what was the explanation he gave you on that? Uh, I, I, I didn't ask for any explanation. I knew it was because it probably was white. Um, but like I said, I've, I've pitched with many gloves that have a white 44 on them. Um, I've been with them since 2017 and I've never had an issue with it. Did it surprise you then that then Abreu has it and nothing was said to him? I don't know. I didn't notice. Okay. Yeah, he did have a white he 44. Yeah, 44. I didn't know. Um, <laughs> Was it Miller or was that Orioles batters who were? I think it was Miller. Um, I think uh, Santander was complaining about something else, not not the 44. Was that not letting him set S S Santander? Um, I think it was because I came set before he was looking up, um, and the umpire didn't, didn't say anything. So I think that's what it was. Mister, are there any words for what uh, Aaron Judge continues to do at the plate, and not only that, the way he does it at Camden Yards? Yeah, he said it last year. Uh, yes, he did. He said, he said, you know, I think last year he started the first two weeks without a homer, and he has what three or four now? Four. Um, so he might he might break that 62. Who knows? <laughs> Why do you think you've had so much success against this Orioles team over the last, not only last year, but to start this? Uh, feels like every time I'm here, I, I, I throw to my spots and I, I'm able to locate um, and use the field to my advantage. I feel like they hit two or three fly balls to left field that probably could have been homers than anywhere else and played, you know, the field played in. So uh, kind of know, know what uh, stadium I'm playing in, you know? Like in a way, judges' greatness is taken for granted because it feels like it's kind of expected now that he does this stuff. No, I wouldn't think so. Um, I think everybody appreciates the work he puts in. Um, everybody knows uh, he's he's the guy, um, and he's he's playing up to it. Uh, there's no way around it. I think he's earned um, what he has right now, what he's doing, um, and, you know, hopefully he continues to do so. What kind of spark has Franchi provided these first couple of days? Yeah, he's, had, he's had great at-bats, um, obviously with those two homers now. Um, you know, it's something that, that you know, we're, we're happy about. Uh, he's, he's contributing and hopefully he continues to, to do so. Is there something to performing, you know, players have different opinions on this, performing really well against the team that cut you, against the team that released you. It's kind of like, you know, a lot of people were joking today about this being the Frenchie Cordero, Nestor Cortez Jr. revenge game. Um, I mean, maybe the first, I mean, the first, yeah, maybe the first few times, and then after that, it just becomes business as usual. Um, yeah, maybe with the first time back I was here, I, I wanted to prove something, maybe second time too, but after that, it's just, just becomes, you know, another game, another opponent, um, and you try to do well against all of them, um, but luckily, I've, I've had good success against them so far. So you can almost see it on Franchi's part, maybe the same thing, I mean, this is the team that cut him in this Yeah, I'm sure, I'm, I'm sure they, they, they look at the two homers this series, and they're like, ah, you know, but. Um, I'm, I'm glad he's on this side now and, and, and he's doing it for us.